Let's balance the net ionic equation for HCl plus HD2NO32. This is hydrochloric acid. This is mercury one nitrate. So the first thing that we need to do with our net ionic equation, we need to balance that molecular equation. This is the molecular equation. I can see that I have one chlorine here and two here. Let's put a two in front of the HCl. So now I have two hydrogens and only one here. Put a two here, that balances the hydrogens. We have two nitrates, two nitrates here, two mercuries, two mercuries. That's the balanced molecular equation. Now we want to write the state for each substance. And that looks like this. If you know your solubility rules, we have these nitrates, two nitrates here. They're very soluble and hydrochloric acid is a strong acid. So that's going to be soluble as well. The mercury one chloride though, even though chlorides are usually soluble, there are a few exceptions in this mercury one chloride. That's an exception. It's insoluble or only a very small amount dissolves. We're going to call that a solid. That's going to be our precipitate. That'll fall to the bottom of the test tube as a precipitate. So those are the states. Now we can split the strong electrolytes into their ions for the complete ionic equation. And note that we don't split solids apart in net ionic equations. That looks like this. So this is the complete ionic equation. And note we didn't split the solid apart. Here's the problem that people have with this particular net ionic equation. When you look at mercury one nitrate, the mercury one ion is Hg2 two plus. So each one is one plus, but this stays together almost like a polyatomic ion. So we need to keep that together and have Hg2 two plus when we split this part into the ions here. So this is our complete ionic equation. Now we can cross out the spectator ions. So if we look here, we see two hydrogen ions in the reactants, two in the products. Cross those out. Two nitrate ions, and then again in the products, two nitrate ions. Spectator ions, we cross them out. But what's left, that's the net ionic equation for this hydrochloric acid plus mercury one nitrate. I'll clean it up, write the states. We'll have our net ionic equation. So this is our balanced net ionic equation for HCl plus Hg2NO32. If you look at the charges here, we have two times one minus, that's two minus and two plus. It gives us a net charge of zero over here. This is a neutral compound, so net charge of zero. So the charge is balanced. And if you count the atoms up, you'll see they're balanced too. This is Dr. B with the net ionic equation for hydrochloric acid and mercury one nitrate. Thanks for watching.